Hi friends, we're going to continue coding. This one, we need to make a ladder. So it says to go east and then it says to go west. So if I go east and then I go west, I stay on this ladder and then I jump. That's not going to work. Let's move this down. I want this one out of here and I want this one out of here. Let's put the jump in between. Now we're going to go here, jump up to this one, then go this direction. Okay, then let's go in a loop. But I'm also going to have to put another jump in. Otherwise, it's just going to go backwards, isn't it? And I could only each use one each one once. I can use I can't I'm stuck. I can't use my any of these anymore. So because they're all right here. So if I go east, jump, west, jump, east, jump, west, and there is an extra jump, but let's see if it lets it do it. Three times. That doesn't work. I only want it to go twice. Hmm. So let's go like this. Then it's going to go there and back, jump there and back, jump there and back, jump there and back. And let's just do it four times because there's four rings. Let's see if that works. Okay, let's try a challenge puzzle. Okay, it says we have to go east and then I have to go down. I don't see any jumps that we're going to have to do in this one. One, two, three, four, five. Let's run it and see what happens. Time to head back to land. So we're going to have to draw a line, jump this direction, and then draw the line. So how many times do I want to do this? One, two, three. Um, but I don't want to jump another time. So I'm going to do this three times, and then one more time we'll go east. Because otherwise it's going to jump off the page. We have to build stairs. So we have to go up. And then we have to go this direction. Over to the east. All of that can be put inside our loop. How many times do we have to do this? One, two, three. Three times. Let's try it. And let's do one more. Says the artist saw something funny in the distance. What do you think it he saw? Okay, let's see. What would be funny in the distance? We're going to go over, I don't have any jumps or anything, do I? Let's go down, let's go over to, and now let's go up. Two 
and over three times. Let's run, see what happens. Do you see what I was doing? Making a spiral. Okay. Let's try this bonus one right here. I need to go up at this direction, then we have to go down, and then we have to go this way two times. Oh, now I need to, nope, not that direction, I have to go, oh, I was right, yep. And that's going to put us where we were. Now I want to jump. And put that all in a repeat. Let's try it. Maybe we'll we can try it. We need to go and what do I have? I need to jump this direction, right? Now I want to go up, go down, and I have to make this side. We're going to go this way and back. Now I want to go the other way and back and put up oh, and I need to set my color as green so I have to go move this over here set my color as green and put the whole thing in a loop set my color first do my whole loop let's see how many times am I going to do this one two three four five six times Run. Nope, didn't do it right. Let's see what went wrong. We were too big. Our problem is we're too big. And I don't see a button that will let us make it smaller. I can change my pattern, but I can't change my size. So maybe in a, in a future one, we'll be able to do this. So I hope you enjoyed practicing loops. Have a good day.